The solubility of vitamins. Using the principle of like dissolves like, that is polar molecules dissolve in polar liquids, water is a polar liquid, any vitamin that has a substantial polar part should dissolve in water. Looking at vitamin A, only a tiny part of it is polar, this OH. The rest of it is non-polar carbon and hydrogen bonds. Vitamin B, on the other hand, has multiple polar parts to it, all around the molecule. And so since a lot of it's polar, it will dissolve in water, which itself is polar, like dissolves like. For vitamin C, again, lots of polar parts to it. Water's polar. Vitamin C has lots of polar components. It will dissolve. So what would we look for, therefore, in vitamin D? The part I've circled is nonpolar, and it's a substantial part of the molecule. So what part would help it dissolve in water? Just this little OH, this polar part here. It's not enough. It's essentially a non-polar molecule. It will dissolve in fat, but not water. Vitamin E, looking here, we can see that most of it's non-polar hydrocarbons. So it will dissolve in fat. There's only a tiny OH polar part. That's not enough to dissolve it in water. So what should we look for here in vitamin K? Just two polar parts, but really the substantial amount of it is non-polar. This will dissolve in fat, but it won't dissolve in water. 